My favorite part of coming here is probably seeing my friends and the teachers, they're really nice. I don't know, I like being able to wear a uniform because then we really get to show who we are and everybody knows that we belong to the school. I like to read story books and fun books. PE, because we get to play. Yeah, gym. I love the playground. I like creative writing and I like reading. I like learning about math and all the different equations you could do. Well, today in science, we're gonna dissect a sheep. Very disgusting. It's my first year in art, but so far I've been, really been liking it. I get to splatter paint and express myself in different ways. I like all the colors that you can just mix colors together and I like that stuff. We get to do a lot of video filming and right now we're doing flash animation which is cool. We get to come up with our own stories and everything. In grade six I was part of the Wizard of Oz and I played Glinda which was really fun. <laughs> it was very glittery. I find it really interesting that you can like use a computer to like alter images and to like um, make websites actually. We get to paint our art portfolios and learn how to play the ukulele. We're doing this project now where we get to create our own rhythms and that's really fun. I like to go on the field and play ball, basketball, soccer. I'm good. I like Southridge because of the new teaching ways, especially like Harkness. You don't have to always listen to the teacher talk. You can express yourself, like you can say your opinions on a subject. I really find mathematics challenging. This year, I'm, my math class is very small, which is very nice, and I really like how there's more time with the teacher and how they can really like help you and like get you to where you're supposed to be, putting a lot of work into it, but it really paid off. I want to be a teacher because then I get to teach kids the things that I learned when I was in school. It would help kids grow to be who they want to be. I want to be a ballerina and an artist, but I don't know if I am going to because I have lots of stuff I want to be. I'm like kind of leaning towards marine biologist and like getting a girlfriend and making all my friends jealous. Yeah. I want to be a police officer just because I like to keep people safe. I want to do something in the film industry, acting or screenwriting. Maybe some kind of doctor, like a plastic surgeon or an orthodontist. I'm not afraid of blood. <laughs> a lawyer or maybe someone who gets to like appear on TV or maybe a photojournalist. Um, I really want to build the bridges. My grandpa this month he was working on Alex Fraser's bridge. Probably towards engineering, like doing something for the community while also being able to be yourself and express yourself. I think it's the little things that really count when it comes to making a difference. I just get this really nice feeling after I help people and they're really happy. Definitely setting an example for the younger kids, like kind of become a habit, you know, just to uh, be respectful, be polite. It's just the small things to make people's day. People need to get off their phones a lot more and just enjoy the outdoors and enjoy being a kid. It's pretty easy to make friends here. I really like this close environment and there's not many people. I, I know everyone, I'm very familiar with everyone. You can express your own freedom in other schools maybe. There isn't Harkness. You can only listen to the teacher and they'll tell you to be quiet if you talk. A lighthearted place of serious purpose. And it really is that, like, people sometimes say, like, oh, it's just a saying, like, we're all one, but no, like, everyone in South is just truly a community and everyone really just makes it that much better. The lighthearted environment and how easy it is to interact with other people, constant interaction and you just kind of become friends. And I was so young coming here, at, like, I, I was only four when I first came here. It, it's been most of my life so far, like, of course, by the time I graduate, it's already going to be, like, 13 years, so. Yeah, definitely won't be forgetting this.